you, you don't stop just because you've had uh, one trick calf. You know, you, you know, there's more calves coming, so um, that's the way it is. It was born on Tuesday. I thought it was a um, a malformed calf in the terms that um, it wouldn't survive. I thought that uh, its leg had been twisted over its spine, and I thought, oh, well, this, this will have to be put down. And um, when I went over, I was uh, quite amazed that there were three legs, and I actually, actually, I was quite happy that um, it was a third leg and not a not a deformed main leg. Yeah. Right, if you, if you feel the skin, right, go down, right down the bottom. You can feel muscle mass there, and it goes into a ligament. Oh, we've seen cleft palates, you know, where it, um, there's no lip and that sort of thing, but um, we don't get a lot of deformities, but uh, when you get them, they're certainly worth looking at. Yeah, it's um, pretty much uh, a normal, healthy little calf. Um, time will tell whether there's any um, other... Um, compromises with the with the um, calf. Um, according to the vets, at, um, the vet Shane Lyons, he said that um, there may be other issues, but uh, hopefully not. So if, if the amputation and is is successful and everything goes well, uh, she'll just join the herd like the rest of the cows when she's a bit older.